we're back and we're, we're playing back. Castlevania. Ha! Get it? Yeah, this is, this is actually a reference to uh, the classic NES game Castlevania. Yes. Yes. Oh man, do it. Right, I forget what the shtick is with this world. Oh yeah, it's all the syringes, cool. Yeah, the. Yeah, oh god, yeah. See? Yeah, so I can't touch any of this shit because I die. Yeah, like that. See, you can tell this game was like an edgy 14 year old Newgrounds game. Because there are syringes and you leave a nice little trail of blood everywhere. We haven't actually showed off the, the replay thing, have we? No, that's because you haven't died enough times yet, <laughs> basically. Yeah. Anyway, who wants to hear more Peter bollocks? Probably not. Every time you say Peter, I keep thinking you're talking about a man called Peter. It's like, yeah, fucking I Peter. I mean, I do, I do know a Peter who is, um... Shit. Well, you said it, not me. <laughs> no. He's a piece of shit. Fuck! Meat Boy is a vengeful, bloody cube of rotting animal flesh. And he smells. They started a sentence with and. You can't <laughs> trust these people. And he smells. After a short... As if you're gonna be like, oh, I don't care that he's made of dead animals, but if he smells though, you count me out. Oh. I'm, not, I'm not in for that. This is just like childish propaganda, oh, isn't it? Yeah. That's what it. That's what it is like. I would like, respect who, who Peter puts if it smells as a defense for why you shouldn't do something. I know. Like, because that's the thing. That's the problem with stuff like this, though. Like, I, you know, I don't like ah, saying I don't God. like Peter or something because people are going to be like, "Oh, do you advocate for the slaughter of animals?" And I'm like, "No, I like animals. I have pets. They're not even really pets. They're more like family members." Before you say any bollocks like that, but you know what I mean. Like, I wish Peter would not awful people yeah like if they actually did what they were trying to instead of effectively metaphorically God damn it. metaphorically wanking each other off <laughs> if you know what I mean yeah Just, yeah yeah we're saving so many animals oh you know it would be better but yeah I fucking hate these fan levels I fucking hate fans Corin. Mike, you can't say All that. All you fans. You can't say that about, like... <laughs> <I fucking hate. laughs> That's going to be a quote for the episode. Just, I hate fans. Just great, Mike. Are we still going to do that competition where we take quotes out of context? I think did so. Did we do that already? We did one, but we should do another one at some point. We, we did it and no one entered or something? I think Alex technically entered. Did, did he win anything? He did win. He did actually win a fabulous prize of a Steam game that I can't remember. I think it was AVGN Adventures? Spoilers! Yeah, he won, a, he won a Steam game. So if you guys out there listening right now want to win some cool Steam games and stuff, then we'll do some competition. Then like, comment, and subscribe. Yeah. Like, comment, and subscribe, and share <laughs> with everyone you love. Let's smash that like bar. <laughs> no, but like, genuinely, guys, you know, like... Yes, please do sub, because please, please we've got do. lots more shit just like this coming up. Yeah, please do all those things, and... I don't know if you want to share. If you want to share them to other people, that would be really cool. And you can pretend we forced you to. It's fine. <laughs> but yeah, like we're gonna. Oops. We're gonna see. I've got like probably at least ten, maybe even fifteen Steam games that I've got codes for that I want to give away. And I want to do competitions, but I don't know if anyone's actually interested in doing them. Yeah. So like, I don't know. Let us know if you are interested and then we'll do some competitions and it will only be silly things like, what did I say on this episode? Or, what do you think was your funniest moment? Or, you know, how many times did we make homoerotic banter in this episode? <laughs> Every episode ever. About 50, yeah. You know, By the way, Corin, like I do love you. I'd, I'd love to play with your meat. Oh boy. Get it? Oh boy. <laughs> Oops. But yeah, we're, we're gonna do some competitions. Join them. Just like, I'm assuming I'll probably tell you Shit. them either on the show or on the Facebook page. Like our Facebook page! Haha! <laughs> but, yeah. <laughs> stuff. We, yeah. We'll do them. <laughs> That's it. You, you know what I'm saying. We'll do yeah. some competitions if you want to win. Just I'm glad comment you, or whatever. I'm glad you started going in for really clear marketing messages, Dorian. Yeah, man. Just comment and shit and... It'll be great. They say that's what you need in marketing, right? It's just like clear calls to action. You need yeah, to man. tell people what to do. Do stuff and all that. I think we're just too British. We're just like we're too polite. Yes, we feel like, bad. comment, and subscribe. If it's not too much trouble, yeah. you know, if it's I mean, what if you, you want don't to mind, do, that would be really nice. We'd appreciate that. Fuck, I forgot to jump. Well, he died. Yeah. yeah. It's 
Because it's dark, man. I can't see what I'm doing. Oh, do you want another tip? Tofu doesn't scream when tip. you cut it. <laughs> <laughs> Neither does me. <laughs> Don't eat anything that had eyes. <laughs> Meat eaters are nine <laughs> times more likely to be obese than vegans are. That's because vegans aren't getting the nutrients they need. <laughs> I'm just saying. Vegetarians make better lovers. You can't prove that. <laughs> yeah, it's, uh, I want to see studies for that. I like how these are tips for the game as well. LOL, meat boys, bad breath. That's uh, not a tip. We should probably clarify, like, I, I don't know. I, I can't speak for you. I don't have anything against vegetarians or vegans. Oh, no, not at all. We just think bad vegetarian logic is funny. Yeah. You do what you want. Yeah, no, seriously, like... It, I mean, to some extent, I, I, I kind of agree with the, the vegetarian No, position. absolutely. Like, I, I probably could be a vegetarian. Like, I don't care about eating meat that much. I don't eat meat very often, to be honest with you. It's like, if I want it, like, if I go out for dinner, or if I'm like, man, I, I really want a burger or something, yeah. then, yeah... But like it's I, just, I could live without meat. But it, I just hate that thing where like people have meat every day because that's what you have for dinner. Mm. It's like you don't need to eat meat that much, do you? Yeah, like I, I like salads, but like, like you know. But the problem is really when you have like, well, it's vegetarians. It's, uh, I hate to say this because everyone always says that, but like it's usually specifically vegans who go on about it all the time. It's like. You know, if you want everyone to accept you for what you do and what you eat, accept them for what they want and they eat. That's literally all you need in this life. Everyone just needs Oops. to be tolerant. Everyone needs to just let people do what they want to yeah, do. If it's I not mean, illegal or immoral, I, I, I kind of let them but do like, it. but they think it is immoral, right? Like, yeah. That the meat is murder thing. I mean, if you honestly thought that someone you knew was a murderer, then you would have a moral obligation to fucking call them out on it. Oh no, that's true. Mm. Right. It's, an, it's an awkward it's like, situation. It's like the isn't religion it? thing. Like, if you genuinely believe someone is going to hell unless you say something, then you should tell them, right? Yeah. It's more immoral not to. Mm, that's good it's point. just annoying to people who don't believe, is all shit. Yeah. I hate that leap of faith, though. Yeah. It's, it's awkward with things like that, isn't it? Yeah. Because you've got, you've got all these atheists as well, haven't you, on the other side. Just go, God, not real! Yeah. But at the same time, like. It's not like, if you don't believe in God, it's not like people are going to go to hell or, like, have eternal damnation if they don't believe, so you don't need to bang on about it. Like, the, at mm. worst, they're just, they're deluded, right? Mm. Just, just everyone try and be a little bit more tolerant, you know? Yeah. Just, if people do things different to you, even if you can't comprehend why someone would do something like at least try and oh, tolerate it, you know, and respect people. That it's turned into a really you. serious episode of Super Meat Boy. Yeah, I, I, it's just it's just important that people have you know people have got to understand that. Yes, I agree. Okay. Hmm. It's the well, it's like the golden rule, isn't it? Like, yeah, just, do unto others. Just be nice. Just don't. If be you a want dick. to play a game about sentient tofu, who am I to stop you? Yeah, just understand that it's an inferior quality version of the game that's actually good and has nothing to do about me. Do you actually like tofu? Because I'm of the opinion that it's fucking disgusting. I've had tofu, like, a few months ago, because I saw a recipe with tofu and I was like, yeah, I'll ah. try it. And it's alright. The texture's really weird, but... That's what I don't like about it. It's a, bit it's a bit slimy, isn't it? Yeah. Like, I don't know if there's a good way to, like... If there's, like, a way to cook it so it goes a bit, like, crispy or something, that would probably be better, but it's alright. Yeah. Like, I, I would eat it. I, well, I admittedly, I eat anything anyway, but... Fuck! <laughs> Sorry. Yeah, I like... Yeah, tofu's alright. I'd eat tofu. But it, the that. texture is really weird. Man, we, we've just been talking about some random shit, haven't we? Yeah, we sure have. Well, that's what we do, my friend. That's that's what... That that's is what like, people tune in for. Yeah, that's Assuming basically... Anyone tunes in for. That's basically all we do. We play games and then get sidetracked and just talk about bollocks instead. <laughs> yup. Sometimes literally. I mean, yeah. How do you feel about testicles? Um, yeah, they're all right. Cock. I how, how do you feel about cock? Is... <laughs> oh, sorry. That was just the next. That was just the <laughs> next. Was, next question. That was my segue. Yeah. Do you like it? <laughs> yeah, yeah. I like the animal. I like the penis. I, I don't like. Shit, that's going to be part of the out of context quote. I like the penis, <laughs> but only one specific penis. <laughs> not not penis as a as a genre. Yes, I like the penis. God damn it! Uh, but I did this level first time earlier. I had a wee practice before we started recording, and yeah. I fucking whizzed through this one. Yeah. 
I mean, <sighs> genitals are okay, you know. If that's what you like, then that's fine. If you don't, that's also fine. Yeah. If you like the genitals of the people of the same gender, the opposite gender, both or neither, they're all fine options. Do what yes. you like. Or don't! I mean... Or, or maybe do what you don't like. Just have a miserable time. Like, yeah. who are we just to judge? Spend a really long period of your time hating yourself. <laughs> Cock. Well, <sighs> no, but yeah, what we're we talking about, I don't know what we're talking about. This is going to be a really weird ed- ed- episode when you look back at this. You'll just be like, what the fuck is wrong with us? Yeah, I don't know why we went so weird and preachy there. Sorry about that, you guys. That's fine. Anyway, video games! Should we, should we just, like, normal biscuit arcade? business and just just talk about dicks and butts and that yeah <laughs> that's, dicks and butts. that's normally our, our our area of expertise so mike dicks and butts i know right <laughs> <laughs> tell me about it no i fucking love this game. so how about them dicks and butts am i, know, I right? right i fucking love this game though. It's, it's just it is good. it's really you can tell by looking at the physics how well made it is and how much care they put into oh, the physics yeah. And I say, with a game like this, if the physics weren't top-notch, this game would be shit, basically. Yeah. Well, this is a game that I bought years and years and years ago, and I still come back to it. Yeah, exactly, because that's the thing. It's one, of those, it's one of those games that's all gameplay, if you know what I mean. Yeah. It's just, it's good because it's a good game. Like, it's made well. Yeah. I think I'm playing this like a chump by waiting for that first cycle. Probably. Go, 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 go. You can just hug the wall, you don't need to do the things. Cool. Okay, what's this one? Daybreaker. Oh, I fucking hate this one. What are those little blobby things anyway? They I, just... think, I feel like someone stole my character designs from Banjo's Egg. I'm just... <laughs> <laughs> they, they look like my little aliens, don't they? Yeah. Oh man, we still got to remake that. Because did oh, we yeah. manage to get the minis <laughs> at some point? So, uh, our, our mutual friend Lucian was telling me he wants to make a t-shirt. That just has a, a a sprite of the of banjo blown up really huge with a caption that says at least I didn't make banjo's egg. Can we can we make that? Yeah, that's gonna be it that's gonna be, be on the official biscuit merch store. Yeah, it's gonna be on our <laughs> our store can that we, doesn't exist. Can we? Uh, okay, we're gonna found biscuitarcade.com and there's gonna be a, a link that says store and when you click it, it's just biscuits you can buy. Yeah. <laughs> uh, we've I don't think have we ever mentioned the plans we've had for our website. Fuck on our show I don't know that we have because um because <laughs> I made this like deliberately shit looking web 1.0 website and set it as my homepage on my computer just because I have so many bookmarks that I was tired of having like folders full of bookmarks so I just <laughs> literally just glorious. have an absolute shit load of 16 by 16 icons for all the websites I visit and it looks like shit. It's got marquees on it and everything. Oh, it's got flaming text because it has to. Yeah. It has to look Here's like... a picture. Yeah. It has to look as shit as possible. It's got a picture of Rayman's face. And when you click on it, it goes, yeah! Because of course it does. Yeah. And I was saying to Mike, like, when or if we ever make a website, I'm going to make the entire website look as shit as that. Yeah. If possible. Absolutely. We're going to talk more about this. Next time, yes, on Biscuit Arcade. Shit, yes. And we're gonna see the boss. Yeah, you guys want to see a boss? It's crazy. Yeah. I'm, oh shit! I'm looking forward. Yeah, bye. Love you. Mwah. Yeah.